with Abigail Gertrude. Hello and welcome to today's news. All roads were heading to Green Garden Academy when we hosted the Region Judo competition. Our reporter Abul Swamad Muhammad has the report. For the first time ever, the regional judo competition was held at Green Garden Academy, where teams from all over the country arrived at the school. A host from white belt to black belt, lightweight to heavyweight, boys to girls battle for greatness. A game full of entertainment as judo students from GGA also competed against students and teams from all over the country. As we all know, in sport, there's always a winner and a loser. This ground created a room for such possibilities. The winners were awarded the medals and the team winners were awarded trophies, including Green Garden Academy Judo Team. Abdul Samad Mahmoud, reporting sports for GGA News at Green Garden Academy. The school hosted an interclass sport day and all students were urged to participate. As the all proverb goes, all work without play makes Jack a dull boy. After a long week of exams, the school took to the field and enjoyed a sports day. They get to refresh their minds. And also they interact with other learners from other classes and also they break their the boredom, the class monotony. When they conduct these activities, they get a, a strength, huh? that is strength. Physically, they become perfectly. It started with the walking race for the girls, then for the boys. Then there was a sack race and then came the ball games. In netball, grade 5 defeated grade 4 girls and the winner was defeated by standard 6 girls. In football boys, grade 3 lost 2-0 to grade 5 with goals scored by Abdallah Ali and Ismail Weko and a 0-0 statement between grade 4 and standard 6. A single girls football match between grade 6 and 5 ended with a single goal scored by Mwakanya 5 minutes before the end of the game. Uh, like some, uh, they are good uh, footballers maybe, but uh, they came to realize after that uh, we had the activity. We hope that we we'll plan for the inter-school events since we have started and uh, we hope that we will, we will plan for the inter-school events. All volleyball matches were cancelled as the pitch was not prepared on time. But surely, the matches will be available on the next sports day. Evelyn Aouda reporting sports for GGN is at Green Garden Academy. Let's note go back to Joseph and find out what is going on. As you can see, at the 2022 PP2 grad ones getting ready for the grand parade, before the parents, teachers, and fellow students will have the teacher asking, telling us a word or two. May follow me. Self. Yes, my name is Pauline Omondi. I'm at PP2 class, and I'm happy because of today. As you see, these are the graduates. There are 36, but two are not around. Why? Because 
some, the two were sick, therefore they gave us a report earlier. Therefore, they are graduating only 34, but two, because they are sick, they are not here. So was it, what is it as to follow? Now we are preparing for parade, and after that we are going to issue certificates to our graduates. Congratulations, madam, and thank you for talking to us. Thank you. Welcome again. As you can see, the children are already getting ready, and uh, I wish them a colorful event. But we are getting back to you, Abigail, in the studio. Thank you, Joseph Moore. That's what we all have for today. DJ says goodbye.